What's up guys, starting right back where we left off, getting right into this battle, having to set up my guys actually. Um, so we're going to throw everybody over into one area, um, just because why not? It only makes sense to do that. Uh, with the exception that yours uh, is going to be a wee bit off. I do want to uh, save her, of course, from any harm that she doesn't need to be taking. Hawken doing his job, taking out stuff instantly. Morgur doing his job, taking out that armor. They're doing exactly what they need to be doing. Janelle's exertion stat needs to be raised. It is really annoying being unable, having just no exertion stat on him. So, yours is too far away. Let's set up that. They do not want to go after my guy. Let's do Sundering Impact! Oh, he's gonna use that. Oh, that really does hurt your other guy more, dude. I don't really think that was a good good call on your part, buddy. I mean, now that guy's got four armor. Like, I really, I don't think you've really thought that through, buddy. Um, oh, there's no undo button on movement, which is dumb, but... It's whatever. If I move loot in there, I'm gonna be unable to actually fight him with Mogur. I'm gonna impale this guy. Send him back a space. Oh uh, yeah, impale also makes him bleed. I forgot about that. And yours are uh, still completely out of range of everybody. Which is fine. Let's kill off a stronger dredge first. We'll just have um, him rest. Ooh. That is, uh, not good. Uh, Gnolf is gonna retreat. Yeah, better safe than sorry. And it's pillage time! Last one standing. Yours is actually going to be able to fight something this time, wow. I'm not using any willpower because I don't know if I can actually... F I'm going to be able to fight stuff after this. Um, I guess I'll use some. I'm going to be able to fight a little bit more after this. Uh, because this time around I will actually have plenty of people. Um, so I don't have to worry about losing one. Uh, so we're gonna kill a few more this time around.
It's just those three. This is good. But Gnolf, of course, is really close and he's gonna get killed. Not much I could really do there, and I moved her in the way. They're really the the only thing I did not like about this game. No undo button. And it's like really needed. It really needed an undo button. Cause this is just dumb. How I can't how I can't move and undo it. Like if I accidentally move someone where in a place I don't want them. Just silly. <sighs> Whatever, yours a died, and I pay for it. Just stop beating up on Hanek. Or Hakan. Hawken. Get the own names right. Stop beating up on Hawken, okay? And Hawken is dead. Lost two fighters and five roll. Pretty good. Okay. Hmm. With the village still a day away, you're eating on the march. Of all approaches, we had words earlier, Siskris. You recall him claiming that he didn't care for your command. You were right in which he did. Let me join your guard and fight by your side. Pride hang on his posture and sincerity in his eyes. We let him in. Um, I don't know what Hawkins got like a pride issue. Um, like the the first two choices were pretty bad. You saw him. So yeah, now we got this guy. I think all it did was it just changed him into a just made him a fighter. I don't think it's like... I don't think he's like actually part of my party. You're close enough to hear Dredge rattling through the building below. Pull them out of the houses, Mogor suggested, so I can't resist an ambush. We'll have better luck in an open field. I don't remember... Oh, this went. Oh, we are. We completely outnumber them. Uh, we're gonna charge. Oh no, we do get Gris. More people, good. Battering Graham, and return the favor. Nice. Why do these have- oh, because that's a generic guy and this is this guy? That's what he looks like in battle? It's pretty- that's a nice color scheme. Um, well Hawken and, um... Gnolf are injured, so I don't want to use them. Oh, uh, that looks good. Uh, this is actually well set up right now. Uh, only thing I don't like is... How this is set up. I don't like Luden being so far up, because what's gonna happen is he's gonna get killed before he ever gets a chance to do anything.
Okay, Bercy, let's see what you got. Mogor is just killing their armor, man. I am so happy I gave him the max armor uh, stat. We're gonna ram through this guy's armor. Ouch. I took out four of my armor. That's not cool. Uh, there's no reason to really rally anybody right now. Ooh, that hurt. Ludin, I'm gonna send them a little bit too far up, but it'll be fine. We're gonna break down this guy's uh, attack power real fast. And while yours is not in range to actually hit anybody, she is in range to get her ability off. It also puts down hot coals everywhere. Fortunately, we couldn't do nothing with Moga. Um. Wrist, we're gonna have him use Battering Ram to send this guy through these guys, so that way they both lose armor. Um, kind of put myself in a bad spot where I actually can't make a play without having to use Willpower. Which is not the end of the world, but... Okay, that guy's down. Uh, Gris is gonna get taken out here. I can already see it. Gris, oh no, that's Bercy. Gris is the other guy. That's right. Just need to get some damage off on these guys, so that way they don't do so much damage to me after... Uh, Gris dies, potentially. Bercy. Well, Gris is gonna probably get taken out, too. Gris and Bercy are not gonna last this fight. Probably not gonna be able to fight after this. Probably not gonna be able to go for the extra, extra stuff. Shield bangers, the stone—they're called stone guards. They are not not playing uh, nice. I can put this here. Yeah, I'll put this here and light it on fire under them. Uh, yeah, Mercy's a goner. Um, make him work for it, though. Ouch. Running in on my... Haha, <laughs> that chain reaction. Woo. Not know I could do that. Uh, Eric walks over to Coles. Not what we want, but I wanted to get that guy t taken care of. They are not letting up on this. 
We are going to impale this guy. Into the coals, so that way he also then has to move to get back to us. Yours is gonna just take him out anyways, I guess. Inverse, he's a goner. We're gonna do nothing for him. Eric, gonna finish him off. And then yours, uh, barely survives. my lesson from last time, so, um, we are not fighting again after this. We are going to pull back and be done with it. Minus two fighters, minus seven overall. Yeah, it wasn't that bad anyways. I'd be saving, like, a few people. I'd be saving, like, three. <laughs> so, not too bad. Bodies blanket the area as the snow itself had turned black and red. You walk between clusters of survivors, taking account of your warriors. I'd only lost nine people in total? I think it was something like that. It was nine, it was like nine to twelve, something like that. Eventually, you cross paths with Mogar. This was a tough one. He says, Hope we don't face worse the further we go. This could be a hint of things to come. Earth the village. The wounded are gathered, and you head towards what is left of the village ahead. That wasn't really a tough uh, fight. We're at the village. Uh, where are we in the map, though? You wandered through the small village where there had been a cacophony of battle before. Now an eerie silence hangs over the place. Bodies of dredge and villagers make a macabre path to houses that have been ripped apart as if by tornado. Yours a stops in her tracks. Hear that? She all but whispers. It sounds like crying. Soon you discover a trapdoor partially hidden by a carpet. Open the hatch. There's gonna be stuff there. A woman scream dies in her throat at the sight of Vol instead of Dredge. Men and women both are huddled together. A baby cries on her mother's shoulder. They are clearly odd to see so many warriors. What do we do now, they ask. So, I can send them to Strand by themselves. I can send them with escorts, or I could tell them to stay here. I lost a lot of people, well, it's not really a lot, but I lost more than what I wanted to back on that one fight that I died from. So send them to Strand by themselves. Minus 30 supplies. Eric watches. I feel almost guilty about this. I know Strand. Even if they make it in one piece, the locals will tear them apart. Not literally, of course, but... Well, maybe literally. I might join them. I don't want to lose Eric! Go if you wish. Then I will. He throws on his pack and soon catches up to the refugees. Oh, I guess if I had sent them with people, I would have gotten more renown. Uh, I don't have Eric now, though. I didn't want to tell him that he had to stay, though. I didn't want to be that guy. No, this be an ass. Okay, so yeah, we're on our way to Ridgehorn, like I thought. First from Haitian. I just wanted to see what that was. I have plenty of renown. 
Let's see, singing stone. Plus two will per kill, plus 20%. Dodge, strength attacks. Uh, yeah, plus 20% to dodge strength attacks is actually a pretty big deal. Um, and let's check out heroes real fast. Everyone is injured. That's cool. Uh, Bercy is in uh, no condition to fight, though. At all. I got stats I gotta give to people. Uh, yeah, that'll work for you, Hawken. You're level 4 now. Luden, getting promoted. Double. Not what I want. This'll do. He's gonna have max- I'm gonna give him the max exertion stat. Because I feel like it. Yurza, they do not want her having any damage. Barzi, can you- no, you're- oh, I needed to go- uh, I need to go back now. Equip my item. I could give it to Luden, but screw Luden. We've already established I don't like him. And we're gonna rest for a day. And... I didn't want to send Eric off. Maybe he'll chump, maybe he'll join back up with us. I don't know. Hear a shout echo in the wind. A standard Vol greeting. A caravan of Vol are heading in your direction. Probably a few hundred in total. You meet them halfway. You must be with Vogner. Was. Vogner didn't make it. You're serious? It's getting grim out here, but didn't expect that. You're flying to Skid Banner. What's happening? Isn't Ufal in charge here? I'm Falsa. Ufer's still in S.H.I.E.L.D. in case he needs to be. He sent me to meet Vogner. Well, you. We've seen nothing happening in S.H.I.E.L.D. yet. What do you mean? No dredge. They never came through S.H.I.E.L.D. They're all pouring out of a uh, rich one. We only just found out about it. One group went that way. We came here. Richhorn, the fort on the bay. That place has been abandoned for hundreds of years. Yeah, maybe that's why they're there. By all accounts, it looks like another damned invasion. Newton forces his way into the conversation. Wait a godless minute, what do you... What do you do? What are you doing? Careful now. You be careful, when did you start? You think men don't remember history? The Long Banner hangs in Alberon. The Second Great War nearly screwed us all. What did you do this time? Who the Fallen is this? Take him and go to Grofim. Are you insane? They're just- they, he's just said an army of judges are pouring out of the fort. Go on to Grofim then, Prince. Having your will in my hands would be worse than doing nothing. This shuts Ludin up for a moment. You can see the battle raging in his head. He looks desperate for safety, but he didn't want to. He didn't expect to flee like a coward. He expected you to come along. He glanced at his men. We're already this far. If this is the Vral's doing, I'll know of it, and so will my father. Besides, you need my help and fighters. If I go, so do yours and Bercy. Loon's unexpected flip flop catches you like a swift kick to the shins. Morgan can't contain a chuckle. Ha! The prince of strong. The prince's courage. I need Bursty and Yurza because I don't want to be down more fighters. And from what I can remember, if I take this fight, I go up to Bridgehorn, there's two fights back to back where I need fighters, where I need people to fight with. Do whatever you like, Luden. I need him, regardless of what happens. I need Luden. I need what he can provide. But now I'm down to 49 days worth of supplies. We're coming up to the Godstone, though. That'll probably be about a good place to pause this for today. I can approach the Godstone, as you recall, the Godstones are built on hills overlooking the Godstone, so that travelers could follow them. So, yeah. 
It does nothing ease your pain. Dread shouts Morga. What is this? Morga shakes his head. A stone slams into the shield of a nearby ball, exploding in a flash of light and razor sharp fragments. Get behind the shield banger, shouts Morga. It's about an even fight. Going to do formation. Her, uh, Gris is still injured. What do you have as abilities? Alice, which provokes somebody. Return the favor. Not bad, not bad. I'll take it. Take it over a wounded Gris. The Nolf has no defenses. Not something I like to see out of somebody. Let's go, I guess. Better than ever. We're gonna use up a lot of willpower here to get some early damage off. Or just completely wreck this guy instantly. That's another choice. Ganolf needs more... Ganolf needs uh, exertion. And he needs... Um... Armor. He needs those two things badly. Hawkins gonna get his uh, ass kicked here if he doesn't, if he's not careful. Get some damage off on this guy. Cause problems, you know. This guy's armor is gonna get broken down though. It's gonna be problematic. I'll send Gandalf over here. Oh, he still walked over that? Whatever. Yeah, Gandalf is already weak. It's not a big deal. Warger is doing his job with his shield breaking. They are not letting up on Gandalf. Not one bit. Okay, Ludin's gonna break through all that armor. Which also, uh, then... Does that, uh... Does the um, shatter thing? That's good. We're just gonna have Yurza keep throwing out um, her fire in an attempt to um, get damage done. Yeah, taking out that shield breaker. That's the main guy I was worried about. Okay, gnoll has gotta run. Uh, can I get him still? No. The one thing about uh, the the slingers is that they um they move after every time you attack them. Which is annoying, but um... Take this guy out instantly, and Gandalf is... Yeah, he's gone. Uh... 
of Yurza use her ability again, and we're just gonna have her keep using that. Worth them all to move. Ah. And then they went back and stepped on it. Last guy, he has no health. Yurza gonna get her first kill, I think. Yep, that, that should be her first kill, actually. Uh, let's, uh, let's kill a few more. We can, uh... What's it? Uh, there are all of these guys. Crap. That is not what we wanted. We did not want all of these guys. I wanted just, like, you know, normal... Dredge. Would've been nice. simple normal dredge is all I wanted. Cause I mean I brought my brought my shield uh my uh, return the favor guys. I'm gonna put that there so that way uh that slinger down there doesn't um bother us. Or if he does it's not as bad. So you're gonna beat up on me, are ya? Well, I'll have you know that that is not a good idea. I would have yours uh, attack um, that slinger that was close to her, that was in range of her attack, but I've it's not worth it. Because then that slinger moves out of the way of somebody else. Oh, okay, that's uh, that's not cool. <laughs> Gotta hurt that guy before he uh, gets some major damage off. Let's do uh, max uh, max damage. So that way, he only does he does the lowest damage. Oh, is no yours is not okay. I'm gonna say yours is in range of that. I'm gonna be pissed. Not like it matters, but I mean, she's just she'd just be wounded. But I'd, you know, I'd rather not have somebody get wounded. Last guy. Here we go. Hey, buddy, come hit me. That's uh. So this guy's um ability is uh. Oh, actually. Okay, since uh, since the slingers have to move afterwards, and Pale is gonna do extra damage. You'll see. Yeah, there we go. So um, what's this guy's? I forget what this guy's uh name is. The guy in red. Uh, assault. 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 Some of them. Um. He has the ability called Malice, which is pretty much like a taunt. Um, anybody that, um, any whoever he uses it on has to attack him.
I really don't want to give Luden the kill here. Um, but yeah, I don't have to. I can give it to Fasalt. There we go. That promotes him too. Uh, minus two fighters, minus nine evolve. That's pretty good. One injury on Gnolf. Did I promote him yet? I really need to promote him. Oh. Surprise wall pull weapons, but not before the whole cart slides off. Suddenly stopped by a low growl. The enormous metal wagon dangles precariously off a cliff. From the end swings a confused yox, still tied to his rein. On top of it, hangs on tight, keeping the whole thing from coming over the side. He's gonna off one hand white knuckling the cart, while the other is wrapped around a tree trunk. I know if I tell him to try to keep it, he's gonna lose it. I have to tell him to let it go. I order him to let it go, try to help him haul it. I know if I try to help him haul it back up, he's gonna die. I know that, and I do not want to lose Gnolf, because I already lost Eric, and I didn't... Uh, choices. Knock the dredger off. All the cart plummets. And all flies motionless. Try to recover the body. That's a good place to stop. Losing somebody. This sucks. I was trying. I knew I. I was. I was trying everything I could to not lose him. I guess I could have ordered him to try to let it go again, but I didn't. I didn't think that was gonna work. So. Well. Thanks guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Really like subscribe if you did. Hopefully. Luck turns around some, and yeah, in the next one.